let's talk about humidity for a second. Of course, it's the water vapor in our atmosphere that TV weather people are always harping about. All I know is that if there's not enough humidity, we need to moisturize. And if there's too much of it, well, hello, frizzies. Now the clammy vapor that messes with your hair can slake your thirst, taking water from the air. Avid cyclists know it's a bummer when you're in the middle of a long, sweaty ride. You reach for that water, and oh no, you're tapped. Well, may you never go thirsty again, thanks to a new device called Fontes. The self-filling bottle uses motion to turn air into drinking water. It was created by Austrian design student Christoph Rechazar. I spoke with Christoph from his home in Vienna, Austria. Christoph, thanks for joining us today on Innovation Nation. Thanks, Mo. It's great to be here. First of all, scientifically, how can you extract water out of thin air? Well, there are different ways of extracting water out of air, but I concentrated on a special one which relies on the principles of condensation. So that's basically the water which is contained in the air condensating on a cold surface. Your innovation is designed to be used on a bike while you're pedaling it. How does this work scientifically? It's basically a condenser which is adapted to a bicycle and the airstream you generate while riding is used in order to support a cooler which is inside the device which brings the whole condensation process into functioning. You named it Fontes. What significance does that name have? Well, Fontes was the Roman god of fountains and of water wells. And it's actually the root word of the word fountain. How much water can the Fontes produce as you're pedaling your bike? The experiment I did until now suggests that under the best climatic conditions, you would be able to harvest around half a liter in one hour. Christoph hopes one day his device goes beyond cycling and can be used in places where groundwater is limited. Well, Christoph, I'm glad the old saying, you can't pull it out of thin air, doesn't <laughs> apply to you. We wish you the best of luck. Thanks very much, Mo.